caramel water, of course, and I have some. Final lamp for Janae. I saw this one. It's the weekend. Good morning. It is Monday. It is a new week. It is time for Olivia to go to school. I literally fall back asleep. But listen, we're going. I'm making our tea. We're about to leave out right now. And yeah the time is a bit chilly so you know we just have to dress for the weather <laughs> all right let me make it today yeah. she's here watching her coco melon well that's not coco melon she looked like all of them pull them today why did you throw that down on the floor all right so we're about to leave out I am tired. Okay, that's not hot. So, yeah. Everyone is at school. I came back, went in bed, 7 o'clock, and I fell asleep. I was not supposed to fall asleep. I was supposed to wake up back. Uh, 7.30 so I could get her up and start, you know, preparing her for school. But girl, I literally woke up 9.05. I fell asleep. So, it is 10 o'clock and we are about to leave out. We're going to reach late, but hey, that's it. Let's pressure for them because I'm, she, they're open from 8, so you can reach anywhere from 8. But, hey baby. Yeah. So that's it. Where's our juice? I'm gonna put a juice. Where are you gonna put the juice? Okay. Put a juice in our mug. In our cup. I thought pushing the cup exactly, but it was on the floor in the car. Like Florida is super bipolar. Like what's going on? Like I thought that maybe because I turned the AC on. But let me tell you something, guys. I kid you not. Okay, perfect. All right, so. Hey, I got me an email. Anyway, since I moved, we haven't been using the AC because we're on a lakeside. So I don't know if that's why. My room is super cold. The only part that gets warm, and that's the area in the house that we need to get like the motorized blinds, is. Hold on. I'm trying to put this in our bag. Is at the front of the house. I want to show you guys. All right, this area, the sun is right there, right now. So it's going to come in. And that's the only part. And that, the only way upstairs gets super warm. But when I tell you, yes, you're like, you're dash of the tea. Show me that she does share tea. She just real simple going to school. One shoes. She have on a onesie with her jeans because it's kind of cold. Her jacket is in her bag. Ah. Hi. Eat, drink your tea. Drink the tea. Take the passy out. Drink it nice. She messed up her shoes. She was showing me. I'm gonna do her edges and we about to leave out. Real simple. No dandy dandy. Nothing at school. If I put something around her head, she don't come back with it. Well, they take it out and, you know, put it in her bag. So I just say, you know what, it don't make no sense. Let her just real simple, go to school, and that's it. You ready to go? Uh -uh. No. <laughs> so anyway, I'll talk to y'all later. Um, we are going to drop her off. And then let's see what this week's bring. Like, what are we doing for this week? Girl, what are we doing? We might get bedroom furniture. <laughs> I'm super excited. We might finally place the order for our bedroom furniture. So let me just say that. And that's a big thing because when we're done with that room, everybody thought that I lose my taste. Girl, wait for it. 
wait for it anyway so maybe that's what we do yeah we'll see but i'll talk to y'all later hey i'm back home i have some leftovers i'm on the phone with cushion my break at school we have this collaboration so we're talking about how we're gonna <clears throat> deliver it karma water of course and i have some what is this called um some pasta from yesterday so i decided to eat it it's not a lot but you know okay so our meeting is done and i'm about to go lay down i literally the time is a bit chilly so i'm gonna lay down take this wig off we're gonna wrap up by this hair a matter of fact we're gonna eat some ice cream <laughs> husband gone back to class so we've done our meeting as soon as he gets off we have a sponsorship reels to do so we're gonna do that but i'm gonna lay down and eat some ice cream i am not cooking dinner today because i still have some food we got some food so the kids have food for dinner what i am going to eat i don't know but we're gonna figure that part out i have some ice cream I'm gonna eat some ice cream and uh, um, yeah, I feel like I wanna eat some ice cream. So do not judge me. <laughs> I'm gonna lay down, get to work. Um, I have two, I have a real supposed uh, Olivia, I think. So I'm gonna get to work and then, ah, uh, what? Is Let's go in the room. My bed it needs to spread, but I'm not gonna spread it. The, the, luckily, this reel that we have to do for Instagram, I don't have to do no makeup, no nothing, because my face will not be in it. So I'm excited about that. But we're gonna um, get to work. I think this camera needs to charge as well. So yeah, basically that's what we're doing for the day. I'm just gonna lay down and eat some ice cream. I really do. I bought the ice cream. I didn't want to eat it last night. So when your kids want ice cream and you low key buy for yourself, I still don't learn self discipline, and I'm still working on it. So I think we'll get there. But for right now, you girls gonna eat some ice cream. All right. So this month is kind of crazy with all the sponsorship. We have a time frame for everything so it's like oh i love this jacket you see this is what happened to me right i have this jacket for over a year i don't because i just put it on to go when it's cold the tag is still in it so yesterday i went to church guess what happened i had the tag of the zara thing hanging out hopefully nobody sees it and i was like babes you didn't see that the tag was showing he said no but yeah that jacket i love it <clears throat> love 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 it i think i got this from my store asos i love the color i should look for the see if they have a black in it and get it so yeah it's really good so that's what's up look clothes that's my blouse this is more what i have like my sleeping with sleeping clothes and sleeping clothes and what and stuff that i put on every day and then i have another white bag right here with some more clothes i also oh i need to go on a call as well with the furniture company rh so i'm gonna talk to the salesperson to see what we're gonna do she will requested a call because i went in store and we've been back and forth communicating and guess what i'm buying the furnitures now because she reached out to me and they are a thousand dollars cheaper so instead of me paying seven thousand dollars almost seven thousand dollars for just two nightstand and the dresser it's gonna be five thousand something so i think i'm gonna do it now so i'm gonna go on a call with her either later or tomorrow i have too much doing today or i might can go on it it's not gonna take that long so we can do that get the furniture so this vlog hopefully i get the furniture and they are in stock but yes girl I'm excited to finally get me some furniture this is how my bedroom looks or bed 
crocheting. I don't know how he sleeps squeezing up the pillows. We're going to get rid of those pillows. I have new pillows. These are my old pillows. I've been using them still. I have two chairs right there, which are placeholder TVs on. I have two wall art. I don't think I showed you guys. It's something that I have already, but I've already. So we have those and we're gonna put those over the bed i was thinking about doing a accent wall but maybe in the future um and my big huge huge mirror this thing is it's so huge like i don't know if it's pulling up on camera but i love it i absolutely love it so yeah and i love that we can see ourselves basically i wanted to get a big mirror i got it and yeah it was also on sale like probably three hundred dollars sale but then i had to pay for a white glove service so it bring it right back to the price which i think i still save because they unbox it and they put it where you want it to go it's real heavy so one person cannot lift it it was two guys and they were struggling with it i don't know if i want to move this i think this is always going to stay in my bedroom right here because yeah it can't move and then on this wall we're not gonna have a chest or a taller dresser as they call it i'm gonna add uh pictures of me and my husband in our bedroom probably one with the kids the whole family or one with the kids alone and then everything else is gonna be me and him i don't know how i'm gonna do it i might do it on this wall come down and on this wall as well but either way we're gonna add something right here and I think I want to add uh, pictures so and then I'm gonna get me a chandelier my room is super cool I there's no eat whatsoever comes around this room so I'm gonna add a cute chandelier in my room I might do black and brass because my room is gonna be black or furnitures are gonna be black so yeah just the bed and I always say I love my bed what is that Let's be true to me. Let's see what it is. We got more new neighbors. Alright, it's nobody. So let me go put back my sleepwear on. This is what I add on. Olivia clothes. I might have to throw this away. So accidentally wash with the black clothes and the color gets so ugly. So I might have to throw this away or I think I said I was going to rub it up and see if the color will come back. So that's the reason why it's there. It looked dull. So let me put on my sleepwear and then we're going to go in bed, get to work, get my laptop. It's on the floor. Bring my bag. It's on the floor because we have nowhere to place it. My Bible is on the floor. Everything is there. The TV is on. Um... Yeah, my uncles should come and hide this card. I'm not dealing with no cards in 2023. So we're going to get rid of that card. But I think I'm going to add two um, wall skunk on the wall. But let me get the dresser first and see if we need that. But yeah. Yeah, so that is it. Let me go lay down and do some work and then watch some TV and wait for my husband to get home. So see y'all later. I'll put the camera up again. All right, guys, we are gonna deal with this area. So this is what I did to here. Now we're gonna use these and um, stick the stuff in it. Right, let's see how we can do that. If the first thing is taking these out, there's tape all over this. Oops, it fell down inside. Okay. We're gonna get newspaper and stuff this up. So the things fell down in there. I'm gonna get some newspaper and stuff all of this area. And then I can stick back these inside of it. I mean, it looks pretty good, plain, like so. But yeah, I'll be still going to put back these. So let's go do that. is pretty 
pretty good because that thing was tacky and it's standing firm so that's done I'm gonna keep these I did break it I don't know if I was supposed to cut it or what but listen it messed up everywhere so we're gonna keep these for any other thing that we have to do and this is good now why am I moving it all right so there we go I wanted to hang the two picture frames right here but I'm gonna see if I'm in the mood I don't want to take them off as yet they're right here so let's put them over here and see Done. so this is how they look so I want to hang them first before I take the thing off just to see how they look I don't know I don't I, I just feel like I like how simple it is but then I was wondering if I could find something that looks better which it has the gold and the black frame of course that I need and then the inside is not too much there's a little bit of brown nude colors and that is perfect you know what we're keeping it but I'm gonna try, let me see all the back, uh, oh. So we're gonna measure these areas and get the stuff. So I'm gonna go inside. I'm gonna attempt this right now before I go take a shower. So let's do that. All right, so we did one already. I'm gonna put the other one up now. It is off. All right, so I really thought I should have put it down some more. I think it is too close. So we are gonna do it over. Let me see from this angle. Yeah, they're too close. Let's remove, I'm gonna do over the bottom one, bring it down a little bit. All right, so even though it's not a big difference it's better and I think uh, I think maybe something is wrong with the top one now but it's not that obvious so we're gonna leave it it is clean I love it I love this all right I like the look from here because it extend the walls so that is done yummy all right, so we're done with this, finally. We're gonna keep this one, so it is what it is. I put this right here. I don't know if it's too low, but it's staying here, okay? I'm gonna go downstairs and look at it. I took the, um, the picture frames down, the, the mirrors down, I mean, because we're gonna hang this, but I'm gonna let my uncle take out the fill out by the holes. You guys can see the holes good, but there's holes there. Right there, yeah. And then this, this is how it looks from here. I feel like I should put it higher so that way you see the beauty. Yeah, I think I'm gonna put it higher. Hold on, let's see. Hey guys, good morning. It is Wednesday and we are on the road. I just dropped Olivia off probably like 20 minutes ago. I'm running late. Went to Chick-fil-A. But, so last night I showed you guys the stuff that I put up, right? Put them on the wall, stuff like that. I am going back to uh, Hat Home to return the first one, the first one that we bought. So I'm going to do that and on my way as usual because I always wait until I drop Olivia off, stop at Home Goods and then go to At Home because everything is in one line. So we're going to stop at Home, uh, home Goods first 
but I stopped to get some nuggets from Chick-fil-A of course because I'm hungry and yeah so that's what's up we're gonna see we also are gonna fix the outdoor so I'm gonna see if they have um, we have the planters already I don't remember if I showed you guys putting them outside but I need um something for the garden so I saw some pot in uh, at home that it looked like you, you turned them over but that's how they were made so I think I want to get two of those what is that? so I'm gonna do that why are these cars driving so fast you know so we're gonna do that but um I'm gonna eat once we reach the first destination if there's anything that triggers anything inside of us then I'll show it to you guys if not I'll see you at home if we definitely if we pick up anything I'll show you guys but to let you know I'm gonna return something and then I need to go home and do my hair so I'll see you because I'm driving final lamp for Janae I saw this one but I was thinking it was too small but it matches everything it will match on our dresser perfect right it is on sale it's a red tag so it was $39.99 now it's $29.99 but I was thinking if it's too small I saw another one a bigger one let me show it to you guys This one is heavy. This one is $59.99. But personally, I didn't want to get her a big lamp. I just feel like big lamp, it will be a little bit more grown. So this is what I'm gonna do. So this is how it looks. If you guys can see. Can you see? I like it. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna buy the cheaper one and see how it looks on our dresser the cheaper one the the smaller one which happens to be the cheaper one Judy, I need it is online one Judy, nine one i was trying to see why they have it cheaper i don't know if it's working you know what let me we should check and see if it's working before right and then this is how it looks I also picked this up but I'm like should I get it I like it I like the painting but I'm wondering if I should get it for some reason the browns I wish the black there's black inside of it as well so I was saying, you know what, I might buy it and then if I don't like it, I'll return it. It's $79, so that is it. And then the lamp that I have right here. But for some reason, I feel like this, I am not going to buy it because it is lean. I don't think it, it gets straightened. So let me figure it out and then you guys will know if I get this. This is cute. And then, so we turn that on. This one is nice. It is $59 as well. And they have another one up there. But let me try to figure this out before I even think about buying it. Alright guys, I think I'm going to leave this for now. Well, actually this is the one that I have. Well, the one that I had. I'm going to leave it for now because I am going to home sense again. And then at home, so I'm going to look something else. But I really do like it. I think it's classy. So, I don't know. Maybe I come back for it. And then... <laughs> then I picked up these let me show them to you let's see I have the um some basically some gallery wall thing 
have two sets i really like how they are and i didn't want one set so i picked up two sets wow. let me show you this is a one set look but i feel like the, the wall upstairs i want it to be i want it to be bold so i picked up two sets and then i saw this diffuser thought it was cheap love it and then i have some marble stuff right there but once we get home we will i will show you guys more i want a bin for my bathroom oh this is cute i bet it's expensive this is $30 i'm not buying it mm -mm. so i need a bin for my bathroom Ooh, a black bin All right, I'll keep you guys posted. But I'm getting out of here. Oopsie. All right, guys, I am home. Here is a hot mess because the kids then put on my wig last night. Let my baby ear mess up all of that. But I was I wore at on the road. Anyway, I'm home, and I'm gonna show you guys the stuff that I buy uh, today. Hmm. Hold on. sorry all right so all right so i got this mirror i went to ross i didn't tell you guys that so i got this mirror it was only 29.99 for the kids room queen and kyra over the dresser right it's like a brass gold really really cute and i got this outdoor rug but it is probably too small but it was really cheap it's a five by seven i mean it can't fit the table now but i am i hopefully i have a sponsorship video to do for a company so hopefully everything goes well so we are gonna get a new outdoor set and i bought these in home goods these are like gallery wall it's two of them we're gonna put them upstairs i'm gonna open one first and see if it makes sense to have two because i really wanted it you know extra um I picked up one more of this it was black but i was like it doesn't make any sense because it's the same size so this is what i got a diffuser this was cheap this was like ten dollars yeah it was ten dollars uh oh man so these are marble all right let me show you guys because i need to go pick up oc I think I might have to pull them out and show it to you guys. Alright, so this is like a marble. It was $12. It's marble. You know, one of those stuff decorative items you put on the anywhere you can put it. So I bought this. It's marble. So I don't want to open it just so it doesn't chip or anything like that. And then I have like a book holder. It's also natural marble uh it's two of them so i bought these as well and this is how you put them with the books you guys can see yeah so i don't want to open them it's marble you guys know marble look it has a little bit of texture in it so that is that let me put these in one bag so that was 12 dollars a piece each of those sometimes i really wanted like a really different look book end book ends but every time i um so this is the gallery wall every time i go i cannot find the good ones this is how it looks so this is how it would look if i do the two sets however i wouldn't place mine like that and this is our one look so this is it. I think the two, the way I want it, it's going to look so cute. So that is that. Yeah, and I have two of them. And then this is the mirror. When I saw it, I thought it was cheap. Uh, hopefully it's not too small. This is how it looks right here. So hopefully it's not too small. Later we'll go and test that. Because I have to go pick up Olivia soon. 
in like 10 minutes but the so this i have something else to show you guys and that's what i'm more excited about showing Ugh, let's go so what else did i buy oh i bought some stuff in ross like some blouse just regular stuff like this that i can wear they are really cute i think i have two for you with, yeah so i bought some blouse in ross that's it the bag is on the table right there Jine is helping me i just seasoned some chicken anyway so i got these in at home they are outdoor planter right let's place it right here they have a, a grayish color i am going to return one because it has a chip they are super heavy so this one has a chip can you guys see it yeah it has a chip and it's so funny when i was walking out the store i saw it and i was like it wasn't a big deal but since i came home with it it's a big deal for me so i want to return it i think they were a little bit too pricey but i like them so this is how they look let me move this Even though they are gray, my table has like specks of gray in it. So I think it can work. So this is how they're outdoor planters, like I said. This is how they look. I love the shape, really love the shape. So I'm gonna fill them up before I take the tags off. I'm gonna fill them up with some moss and um, put paper bag and moss inside of them and see how they look. But this is how it looks and then if i really like them when i fill them up then this is complete i will go back to at home and i'm gonna change this one because i'm not keeping it it even though i can put it around the back it has a chip but yeah so this is how it looks later or tomorrow because i'm gonna come back home and cook i'm gonna fill them up with some moss and we are gonna see how they look but i'm a little bit excited about them i was worried about the gray but i think it is okay what do you guys think i don't know i feel like i like it but i'll see if i really 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 like it once we had the mask to them because it's not giving right now only the shape is giving because this is a shape that i really wanted but i'm gonna go get olivia and then come back so to me for now it's like i don't but i like this shape it's like this one is more like it have a vibe you know so that is it yeah but they have a smaller one i didn't want the smaller one the smaller one was like 29 dollars if i got the smaller one i would i would buy three and then the smaller one is not big like this so i was like if it was the same size as this then i'll have it but I was like, let me get the bigger one. So I like them for now. But we are going to um, come back and see. And that's all I did. I am done with the road for this month. I actually went to Home Goods just to search for these curtains. I saw curtains and I, I didn't know what. I don't know why I didn't buy them. They were $79 for two panels. And I could put them out there. So I'm still going to search for curtains but that is it for this month and then next month i'm gonna buy the curtains for my room because we are getting furniture by next not next week vlog but the other vlog you guys will see i think furniture because we finally placed the order for our bedroom furniture so that will come in in a couple of weeks and look at this in the daytime i love it i love it when i went to at home they had some new stuff but I was like, nah, I still do like this. Even though it has the gold in it, I think I still do like it. You know, but that's that. What else? I did place the other stuff right here. I think I like it, but too much gold. So when this move, I'll probably like it a little bit more. So that's all that look for now. And I'm done. I need a planter. I'm gonna go on Amazon. I saw one on Amazon. I was I was so I refused to pay $85 for the one on Amazon plus one them are on tax. So we we need to look for a planter. I might go to Home Depot and get it, but this is not like priority right now because right here is not fixed. 
so I need to go get um, a pot but that is it that's it for today we're cooking curry chicken rice and some asparagus but we're gonna pick up Olivia first and Janice brought this to me last night it's like a wine opener from Brookstone yeah includes foil cutter okay so she brought that to me we'll have that for the house and I bought some air freshener at home and every time I pass them it is white cotton if you guys have a hat home go look for these you can put them in your bathroom in your closet this smell so good when I tell you like every time I pass it I pick up one I was like uh-uh I need another one so yeah let me Jin why you never put the water on the rice all right so we're gonna do this and then go for Olivia so I'll talk to you guys later the other kids they have practice I think this is too much rice the other kids have practice so Kushin is at practice with them you ready yeah all right let's go it's time for her to go to school yeah yeah Morning. showed you guys these but we'll talk about them because there's no plan in them come come walk walk pretty girls walk like this 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 what did i care go you know you're late you're late every morning to go to school yeah <laughs> this is not where you sit go around your side Hello, this is not where you sit. All right, guys. Uh oh. Uh oh. Come on. This is where you sit. Uh oh. Olivia, you eat candy and you throw the thing right here. Climb up in the car. Let's see you up up in the car. She can't go. She can't go on. Go on up, Miss Trapper. Don't. But when I go to school, it's something that my nose, you know. I feel like something that my nose. Uh, this is the boy that my Jamaica talk about. Wait. Can you all see? Let's squeeze go in. <laughs> Come baby. Come let me strap you down. Sit. She down. She down. She down. Alright, let me strap her down. Sit baby. Say bye. Say bye bye. <laughs> All right, let's up in the front. You look like a crackhead mouse. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay, I want clean, but let me show you. Me, if I'm tired, I'm more happy to add. Just in case we don't feel like we go inside with my tired and we feel like we catch Olivia Cool. Set up our iPad in here hot. We can't be carrying different inside hot. Oh child. Alright. Well I'll do. Well I probably not see everything right this time. It doesn't look so Drink it. Drinking my karma water. The girls who get it, get it. The ones that don't, just be following. <laughs> yeah. Uh. 
tired. I try to drink one or two a day. But if you only drink one pepper, you can't afford it. About the case at Sam's. Alright, let's get this going. I'm stuffy. Alright, guys. So, guess what? We're doing a little bit of self care right now. I'm soaking my feet. And this is what I'm using. It comes from Jamaica. When I tell you this thing works, it works. Love it. I don't have to rub my foot, nothing. It just gets soft. But the last time I did this, the Chinese them rubbed my foot. And I don't know how people really got to them. I personally don't like it because I feel like it let my foot get tougher or feel tough. And that's what's happening. So I'm just doing this. I'm going to take care of it. I have a lot of stuff right here that i'm gonna rub scrub this that i even have a mask foot oh it's a foot scrub so with black salt i can use that as well i have those for a long time i think and then i have a foot a barefoot uh, mask as well so i could use this let me see how this use i'll probably buy these from the time um when we did uh, cushy and pedicure so it's a one single use here hydrate intensive hydrating well, let's see how it put disposable booties over clean dry foot secure clothes booties watch I know and I can't be ready so this is how it looks I did buy this it's on dry foot so I might not use that or I might wait until I'm done but really, I'm trying to do only 30 minutes because I need to go take a shower. So I'm doing this and it's 12 after 12, 1220 right now. So we're doing this until probably like 12, like 45 or something like that. And then I'm going to clean up my toes. This one is finally growing back. So I'm going to clean up in between my toes, kind of rub my foot a little bit and stuff like that. Give it some pamper. Yeah. It is super late. I am up, of course. I am going to prep for a wig. Let me see what time it is. I it's almost two o'clock. So, so this is what I was doing. Today is Thursday. Even though it's Thursday, I wanted to clean the bathrooms from today, and I did that. Right? Oh, my face is so moisturized right now. I just literally done taking a shower. My foot feels so freaking good you hear me when i tell you it feels so good it feels different i need to start doing this i think i'm gonna stop letting people in general touch my foot i'm gonna when i was in jamaica i used to polish my toes myself i'm gonna get back in tr on track i do have the light i did purchase one of those on amazon so i can do it myself so i think i'm gonna um yeah, get me some good nail polish and top coat because I have the ones in the dollar store. So I'm going to get me some good nail polish, the top coats, and I'm going to start doing my toes myself every two weeks. Rub my foot, soak my foot, and they feel amazing right now. You hear me? Even though I didn't polish them, I just cut them, foil them, all of that. They feel so good. So anyway, did that. I took a shower. Um, I don't know if you guys had saw these for some reason. I think I'm gonna move them. They're too goalie goalie So I might move them or I don't know if it's because the mirror is right here. So it's clashing with the mirror So this is the plan. So this mirror right here. It is too small. It is 24 inches We are gonna bring it back to Ross. Luckily I had these the only thing I was trying to take the, the, the tag off 
to clean it before I try to hang it but then when I put it up I was like uh-uh it's too small so the tag is still there over there so we're gonna return this and look at it the design right there and this one if I'm not mistaken oh my god it is the same thing oh it is the same thing look it's the same mirror so probably Sam's just have this company make the mirror or they're all using the same thing. But it's the same mirror. So we're going to return this and look. It is 24 inches like I said. We're going to look like a 30 inch or 32 inch. And we're going to hang that. However, I did move the... I did move the... The... the what are those called? I remove the the wall art in Janae's room and I put them in the kids bathroom so we're gonna sh I'm gonna show you guys I uh, think because it's neutral I don't know if I'm digging it but they're staying just to let you all know they stay because it is okay but you tell me is it just okay that the thing with me is if I'm not blown away by it, I feel like, uh, but it is okay. I'm just not crazy about it. You see, my plant over there, since I changed my plant, I'm crazy about it. What else am I crazy about? My stairs, I'm crazy about it because they change the color and it looks so good. Let me see anything else. I'm not crazy about my TV being so low either, so just letting you guys know that i am not crazy about my tv being that low what i'm crazy about the mirror in my room it's not like i like it i'm not crazy about the mirror right here i love the mirror but it's not for this area right here what else i move the um so right here we have the the piece of wood right somebody commented in the video and said i should paint this yes we're gonna do that but this is not priority because in in real life i think it is okay it doesn't it's not yellow the what you're putting there right up on something it is not yellow i don't know why is it giving that yellow vibe so the color it's okay right it looks fine would look better in black but it's not a big deal let me move this let me plug this out i want to show you guys and let me tell you something about this printer it is very important because all the contracts that i have to sign with these sponsorship i don't have to go nowhere i have my printer so these are gonna move so act like you don't see them i just don't have nowhere to put them so i love this like this the height of that tall vase and then this bowl I love it without the plan somebody did mention that the books are hiding you are totally right I just love the piece of wood and I wanted to put it up as the first thing <laughs> in the house so this looks so much better to me and I think I'm gonna run a card I'm gonna let my uncle make a um, a plug inside here and put the printer inside of it that way it's more I mean it's gonna be less functional but it's gonna look better for decor otherwise it still look okay to me so I like it like this and then we put our keys in this thing right here our keys are in this this original is for my bedroom with the black and stuff but I like it and I have a lot of books I love the Louis Vuitton book it's my favorite at this area because of the black I just feel like it brings out so much in it and yeah love everything so it is what it is you know and then even though these they're not fixed properly i love them on the wall as well i further on i'm gonna fix them because it just looks so cheap it might not look that way to you guys but they need to fix all right then these two spares for some reason i wish one was bigger than one I still have the tag on this one. I think this one is more expensive, but I wish it was so bigger. I really do like them at the stairs. Y'all might think, really? But yeah, I love them. I I don't like them. I love them there, to be honest. So when this clear out, I'm going to see how it looks, hopefully. I do have the thing for there, so I have so much update to give you guys. But before I put the thing that I'm going to put right here, we're going to 
two inside here i finally get the other couch so we're complete now which i don't think i'm gonna put the complete set in here i think i'm gonna leave these chairs the brown chairs inside of here so i might bring the two accent chair a lounge chair that i have from the company in my makeup room if that makes sense so that is it we are gonna go upstairs let me put this back we are gonna go upstairs because i have my um hold on i'm gonna start oops it gets dark wow let me turn this light on <laughs> so we're gonna go upstairs and i'm gonna start this wig that i have to post i want my uncle to come because these holes right here and then we're gonna hang this and then i'm gonna show you guys in the kids bathroom the tooth stuff that i put up in the bathroom let's start from here i love these right here they are a vibe so this is it this is their bathroom well Kyra and Quinn Kyra and Quinn yeah and then these are the pictures this is how they look inside the mirror I have the option to turn them this way horizontal or vertical so I decided to work with it this way in their bathroom We do have two, I think I showed you guys those. I just need to get the prints for them. And yeah. I tell them to keep this door closed. But this is it, what do you guys think? Do you guys like it right here? I think it looks good coming back now. I think it looks good. So say you're coming in their bathroom and uh, yeah i think it looks good it looks good this way now this one right here i think this one could be a little bit bigger but guess what child we gonna let this stay for now we're not even looking at her all right yeah we're gonna let her stay for now so this is it the plan was to put this back in the girl's room it's too much pink it's just giving me too much pink so this is their curtain rod so let me show you, even though they're sleeping, they're in one bed. Oh, I did put these over here. I don't know if I like it, to be honest. I don't know if I like both of them. If I'm gonna leave them all of this gold stuff, that uh, pineapple and that thing over there, we're gonna, we're gonna um, move them. They're too, it's too much gold now. So right here, this is a dresser. I'm gonna put their lotions and stuff in their bathrooms. And I was thinking to put the thing right here. Should I? But I was saying they need a mirror in their room. So it's best to just get the mirror, you know, instead of putting back that there. I also put this one up back. This is the favorite piece in their room. I love it it whites just blends into the wall and then you have the gold and the pink really do love this absolutely love it i think it's real nice and it just goes into the wall however i'm gonna add wallpaper to their room i know the wallpaper that i'm gonna add the room is gonna feel smaller i know that so i want to make sure i minimize everything i think the pink thing probably could go here you know and then I'm debating if I need the pink curtains that we have or should I get gray? Let me show you guys. I need to fix them. I need to fix. So I do have the pink curtains right here. I have this for so long. Your light light. I think this will look so good in their room. Only thing it's 84 inches. And I really wanted their curtain rod to be high up in the ceiling. Y'all know if that curtain rod is not it's kissing the floor it looks so cheap and tacky so I didn't open these because of that this is their linen closet and we're gonna further on we're gonna get them different sheets and stuff I was trying to rush and it makes no sense and then they have this thing right here it looks so cute I had to buy it and they have their robe just in case they're cold that's Quinn and Kyra Janae has hers in her room 
so that is it but yeah we have two of these uh curtains which is two window panels oh two is on this and two we don't need so much so i was thinking do i need these because they're 84 inches so i might have to just um do the uh the curtains cannot the, the rods i cannot do them to the ceiling i mean the ceilings kind of seem a little bit higher right here but yeah that's it too much talking i'm gonna go and um do my start this here i'm not gonna do the hair my hair drop off the bed hold on what's wrong with your hand it must have contract all in there huh let me put over quick i'm gonna need to sleep in each bed but come go up on the bed lie down Cairo. I cannot wait. I'm gonna do a sponsorship video for a company with some ceiling fans. Oh, ceiling fans for for Ginny and Kara's. Oh, yeah, for their room and Ginny's room. I cannot wait to get them because I think that they feel hot. And I do have the this inside of here. Where can this up mirror again? The purifier, the, the humidifier, whatever that shit is. We do have that in there and it feels like a fan so yeah but as i was saying right here we're gonna have a family gallery wall right here you see this is the stairs and i really wanted railings but i think i like this now like i was upset i don't have railings but guess what i have kids and yeah but we're gonna add the family gallery wall right here on this wall and it's gonna be so cute i cannot wait to do it so this is where we're gonna have it and then upstairs is complete like everything is complete so i'm excited to do it let's step back just imagine you climbing the stairs nothing is really on the stairs and then boom you see all the pictures in black and white it's gonna look so cute but yeah how bad is it and that is it i'm gonna go do my hair and i'll talk to you tomorrow i'm talking for almost 15 minutes now my makeup room is a hot mess i don't even want you guys to glimpse inside of here i literally just spread my bed and i don't know what olivia used mess up the sheet this morning <sighs> anyway um we ain't got no decent spreading right now because we ain't got no furniture. I literally washed the sheet Tuesday and today is Friday. But you know what? It's white. We have a baby sleeping with ya. Alright, so let's see. These are the blows and stuff that I bought in Ross. I wanted to show you guys. This is one of them. Why this feel like an extra large? This is not even my size. It feels a bit, but yeah, it's an extra large. I took up the wrong size, so that's one. This is just a regular, no, this is not mine. Two of these are not mine. But then the, let me look for the other one. These two Levi's are for my nephew. This one is a Levi's. Can you guys see? Yeah. Oops, oops. Hold on need something to catch the camera let's use this perfect so this Levi's is for my nephew this is what it looks that's one this this one looks like something with a wear this one so let me put these to the side they were really cheap too they were $7.99 a piece you know you can just put them on this is mine this is just a plain shirt if i'm going to drop olivia off i can wear it it's really thick it's the brand kongal uh this is mine as well this is something i can dress up in i might wear this today <laughs> this one was 13.99 really cute dressy top all right what else i think i buy some shirt that them extra large shirt here like i made a mistake and took the extra large off this is extra large i don't know what i'm gonna do with that 
all right so i bought two of these these are cute one for me and one for Ginny. and these were 7.99 too i think who is on it it's alia let me see which one is mine oh my god why I, do i have so much extra large shirt this is not cute this is the medium hopefully i have another one no so i really bought the extra large for myself at this point that's what i feel like this one is also mine you know just my regular tops that I can wear with jeans or my leggings tights this is another one this is another one y'all know these and then this is a long sleeve dressy one I can wear this as well this is cute this reminds me of an H and M top this is for Jenny this one is Ginny. You know them look so cute. These are this one was $5.99. So the medium shirt that I bought, it's for Ginny. I have to give it to her because I told her about it. And this was something else. Just to dress up. Not dress up but wear. I wish it was large because it's cute. Like you see how I have on the leggings. I can wear this with the leggings. Just like that. I'm gonna give Jine the medium. She loves the big t-shirt type of vibe. So I'm gonna give her these two because I told her I bought them for her. And then this one again. You know, so this one extra large. Yep. No, this is large. This one is cute and fun. But that is it. I might return these because I have the mirror to return at Ross. So I might return these because I don't know what I'm gonna do with the extra large. Like they can't fit me. And I have three. This one as well. Yeah, I think I'm gonna return them. Even though they're seven dollars. I could just send them to Jamaica. See, they're super big. This one is her like her her the heart is her all right and then remember i told you guys that i'll be wearing full black when i'm going under i have on a black tee this is h and m and a black leggings this is how i'm dressing comfortable i went to wash my car i dropped olivia off and then i went to wash my car because we are going out on a little solo date it is after one i should leave out already that's what's up i'm looking at the mirror the mirror is actually cute like looking at it it's really cute it needs to clean though. i'm gonna clean it i hate to see mirror messy so right there it needs to clean so i'm gonna clean it then take a shower and then we're gonna do our hair my hair looks really bad so yeah can't wait. i'm gonna put a wig on but i'm gonna take a shower first i should look what i'm wearing Lord, my favorite one, little boy. <laughs> I think I'm gonna wear some hoop earrings. I'll take, keep this one in and this one and put some hoop right there. I have these that I can wear. It's been a long time. I don't put on no glam glam up accessories and all of that. So I feel like I wanna get dressed today. I've been just slacking on self care. So. We might dress dress up today. What do you think? You want to do a getting ready with me? Hair, makeup. Hair and makeup. Hair and makeup. Well, I have to do the hair video regardless because it's, it's a sponsorship. So I have to do my hair. Well, you guys will see. So I have hair, makeup, and getting ready. So let, let's look outfit first. Let me get away. Let me take away these. And we're gonna look outfit. My uncle is actually here. Our friend that lights are going up today. Music playing, so we have to be careful. So we have the pendant lights going up. Yummy! But that's a whole different thing. Let's clean up right here. This is the wig I had on. Um, yeah, let's clean up this area right here. Let's get it. Let's get it together. I'm going to plug in my phone and then I'm going to charge the camera. But I'm going to look close and show you guys what I'm wearing. So. It's the weekend. My white girl, why are you here? It's like this. We're going to eat some food. I am not in the mood. This seems like... 
Wash that hair. Red Quaran Queen. Alright, so this is a vegetable. I'm excited to eat this. I mean, I don't want to eat it. What is this? Rice? This is part of the rice. So we didn't cook. Why is it a stretcher? Oh, that's the fish. Up school for all that. <laughs> Yo, don't have black women from the camp. So you feel cute. Oh, you got planting. We have planting right here. You want one? Oh, she don't want it. Here. Give me. Mm. Give me taste. Mm. No, I mean, all right, let's see what else we have. Rice. Oh, there's more rice. All right, so I'm gonna share this food. I'm excited to eat the vegetable. It looks so good. I'm gonna put some. What you call that thing? All right, guys. Almost three thirty. I start cooking, and I thought that um, we can eat the ice cream. <laughs> I think so. The, the thing while also. Yeah, pizza cooked from now. I'm gonna lay down with Olivia because she ain't have work doing. I've tied up my ear, I'm just gonna clean my face off. Oh, Kyra phone needs to charge. The kids have put their phone, hopefully I wake up, they wanna go to church, so I look their clothes and everything all ready for them to go to church. So that's what's up. I'm gonna send off this ear video so it can edit. So we can post it. I think I'm posting it for Monday. It's posting before the weekly vlog. Hopefully, I don't pull my hair out so we could do a little date or do a little something. I need to get my thing up because I have so much wig. I need to stay on top of slaying my hair. Like sometimes I'm just not in the mood. I don't know if it's because my beauty room is not set up as yet, and that's the last room I will set up because if you guys watch the ear videos, you guys don't know the trash that is inside there. It's just that, um, it's just that, how would I say it? It's just that I don't think nobody's coming in that room. So if, if it's on the vlog, you guys won't see it. And because I'm transparent with you guys, I tell you guys that room is a hot mess. It's my business, we work from home. So we're always gonna have boxes in our house. We're always all gonna have stuff in our house. The good thing is that um, I had a coach that Kushin had in his studio now, have in his studio now. So I have a little bit of space left in my storage and I refuse to get another storage. So I'm gonna put the boxes upstairs because you guys know I have the skincare now. When I'm buying products, I buy them by the thousand and stuff like that. So we are fully stocked with everything. And yeah, like, why do I feel like I wanna eat ice cream? Today I went shopping and I buy so much fruits and vegetables. Monday, tomorrow is the last day that I'm eating. I'm gonna eat less and no juice. I'm gonna try and drink no juice. Eat less, no juice. So I still eat my rice, but a little bit of portion of rice and more so vegetables and stuff. We get an AC, so we have this AC to review. On the family channel my uncle looked at it today so pushing it we're gonna put this in the studio room so we have a standing ac summer is coming y'all get you one of these all right so i don't know if you guys will see this ac before um it is posted but i just wanted to let y'all know but yeah that's really it um, I went to bed early. I don't know if this morning I told you guys. I went to bed like after 11. Can you guys believe that? And I woke up like this time or after 4 last night. And then when I wake up, I was in bed and stuff. And then I went back to sleep. I really do miss just chilling in bed. Like, you know, just going to bed. I'm not watching no movie, no Netflix. I feel like once the house is... Um, 
at a place where I'm comfortable, then I'll start relaxing more, going to bed early because this morning I woke up super early and I feel so good. So I feel like, you know, waking up early is definitely gonna help. So, you know, I'm just gonna pray about it and ask God to just guide me where I can get things done and stop worry so much about getting things done and take my time to do stuff. But once the house is a little bit more furnished and stuff like that, then we are definitely gonna take a little step back and just, you know, make the day productive so we can go to bed early, which means um, preparing meals from early. Like being that the kids are gonna be in school, even Olivia, start preparing dinner and make sure I'm done cooking by three, four, five the latest. Why? I wanna do it early whereas the kids can eat something before they go to practice or stuff like that or make lunch or a little snack so they can eat at practice instead of getting them foolishness or they're eating snack, like literally snack. Yeah, and just cook dinner so as soon as they get home they can eat and by that time it's only Kara and Quinn start eating, everybody else eat and I can clean up the place before 10 o'clock and not try to fight to clean up the place 10 o'clock and then by 10, 11 I should be in bed relaxing waiting to fall asleep what I'm reading or and I'm gonna do a lot more reading what I'm reading or um, watching something as soon as my room is furnished I'll definitely start enjoying my room a little bit more so I'm super excited guys and with the grace of God everything is gonna work out I think I'm gonna turn the peas off now until tomorrow. I'm like, the peas are soaking. Why not start the peas? You know, so I did that. It's done. I might make porridge tomorrow. The kids should wake up early. I hope I wake up early. They wanna go to church, so we're gonna drop them off. I'm not going tomorrow. I feel like I want to rest, so. I'm gonna go in bed with Olivia now. And um, you guys saw the pendant lights, right? They are so cute in my opinion I absolutely love them but I know you guys see it I love the black oh my god I love the black faucets I'm happy I didn't go with the black and gold because it would be too much gold so I really do love it I love this right here I just love everything just excuse everything act like you don't see nothing else and just look at this it is so cute order the bulbs they're coming Monday so you guys will see those on Monday um another thing love these plants I don't know if I get the real plant they're gonna go somewhere over there like oh I have that one right there I'm gonna keep this like this for now I might change the florals but I love this I love this look I'm not gonna lie really really love it so yeah I'm happy just that alone with the soap and everything and it's cute now i want your guys opinion look at the counter there's a little bit of gold right here right we have a lot of little touches of gold don't look at these bar stools we're gonna change them but just look at the cupboards right now with the pendant lights and everything on the countertop do you guys think i should go with gold brass hardware or should i go with the black and just keep it like that but you're just gonna see black knobs black on black some people be like it will not pop but also i want you guys to keep in mind that i have a lot of cupboard space and they're close by each other so too much gold i just don't want the house to have too much gold i just want touches of gold like this and this one over here so tell me what you guys think should i do the black on black let's vote let's see in the comment section black on black or gold and or the gold into the black because you know why I want to get some big like a 12 inch hardware so I want them to be super huge instead of this small I want them to be big so I know the black on black it will not look too much but if I go with the gold I will have to use the smaller regular ones but let's talk about it tell me I look great I look great great good morning it is Sunday and I hate this big bonnet, but um, good morning, guys. <clears throat> I'm a little bit upset. 
because the kids miss church. So what had happened was we all slept in. Like, ugh, everything do happen for a reason. So we ain't gonna complain. But um, yeah, I'm a bit upset because they wanted to go to church and they were up I'm not gonna lie they were up super late and so maybe that's the reason or I don't know but I'm upset I wanted them to go to church anywho we're up and I'm gonna cook breakfast dinner and all of that I'm gonna just try and do everything at once I'm gonna have to wash my sheet again. Literally, I wash my sheet two days. But Olivia, um, she puked on the sheet. So everyone is up and Christian is in the studio because he has homework. And yeah, see, they wake up and I have to open the windows. That's not my job. Why the window is not open? Why do I have to come down to open these windows? Olivia is up there, right? Yeah. All right, so yeah, that is it. I'm about to start. Well, I actually cut the piece from last night. I showed you guys that, so. I have a set of clothes to wash, so I'm about to do that. And the top that I had on, Olivia puked me up, so I had to change into this. But yeah, let's get to walk. <clears throat> Ugh, I feel so, you know, you just want to relax. I feel like Sundays are for relaxing, you know? Yeah, that's what it's for. But, um, I'm cooking porridge as per usual and I didn't cook it yesterday but we're doing that today so we're gonna enjoy breakfast and straight into cooking I'm, I'm gonna just cook the rice from now and get it over with so all I have to do I have two fish one for me one for the husband and I have some drumsticks that I will be um what am I doing with them I think I'm a barbie fried for the kids I think they do love that chicken so that's what I'm gonna do I have like six or seven pieces so what that should do but let's get to um, work. Let's get to making breakfast and all of that. It is after 11. Like, it is late. So, yeah. Why, why do I have so much milk? Oh. All right. I have the chicken to fry. I literally finished early and I was like, I don't want to uh, finish everything right now. So, I'm saying, you know what? Let me show you guys some Amazon packages that I have. Just a few something, nothing too big, but you don't know all the things set. Y'all be a part of everything. Everything. <laughs> so I was like, let me show the girls what's going on. And the guys, if we have guys over here, you know. Do we have any guys over here? Do we? If we do. Hey, boo. What's this? Black, and they're really cute. I think this was like $9. I showed you guys this before. I love it. And this part, oh, it's easy to come off too. The wall of them easy to come off. Olivia keep taking them off, but that's fine. I have another pack of that. I opened this one already, but I have another uh, tissue holder. I'm gonna put this in the guest bathroom. I think I want a gold one for the for the the powder room. Let me see what's in this. Oh. These are for my self-care videos. These are some petty sponge. This was a lot for the price. And then I have this diffuser. I showed you guys this diffuser already, but I'm not sure how it works. So I was like, let me open it. The color is amazing. I love it. So it will definitely match everything that we have going. Yes, pretty girl? You cannot eat no more candy. Was ten dollars. Kara Quinn, you know that's in the air for corn. Then this is the oil. Let me see if it smells good. I can't smell it, but anyway, we 
have a diffuser right here. I'm not ready to use it. Low key, I don't want to use it as yet. But I was just being enough and went ahead and opened it. So let me put it back in the box. Let's see if we can get everything back inside there. Olivia, come here. But I like it. It's not too bulky. Somebody will call me. Let's see what's in this box. I also ordered the bulb for the pendant lights. So okay, so me personally, I'm not running no wires in my house. There's just too much options. I saw this on TikTok and I bought it because we're gonna add these underneath your remote, right? We're gonna add these underneath whatever pendant lights we decide to do. Last night on President Sale, I bought two skunks, wall skunks. I keep messing it up. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Two lights will pick up on the wall. My pronunciation with things is not well. I think this is... Why did I buy a bowl? Oh, this is for Janae's room. This is for Janae's room for a paper towel. We're gonna put it inside. I really could have used a black because it's not gonna show. And that's all. That is all. I put the dispenser in my bathroom. I think in last week's vlog, I showed you guys like, I don't have any um dispenser. I don't have any tissue holder in my bathroom. So listen, we keep this so ghetto to have the, um, the tissue on the toilet all the time. And I was making a mistake when I was doing, I think I was putting battery into Janae's nightlight that we got from the dollar store. And I keep saying, another word i wasn't using the word battery and i was like chrissy you keep repeating the same thing and it's not even right so i'm not sure every time i watch about my videos i try to make corrections in the other week's vlog just to um just in case i'm like i keep repeating the same thing over and over i don't remember what it was but you guys know what i was talking about and i'm pretty sure people see but they probably say you know what let me not even point it out but y'all understood Sometimes you're talking and you're vlogging and you don't realize what you're really saying until you watch over the video. And then sometimes you're vlogging and you be talking too much and you're like, girl, shut up now, no? <laughs> I tell myself, so you can't shut up now. They get it. Yeah. Take up the coconut water. You want cookie? You want a cookie? All right, this child, she be eating. Thank you. All right, she get herself a cookie. Excuse me. All right, so that is it. Let me go fry this chicken because I have to comb Kyra and Quinn's here. So let me go fry the chicken. I just wanted to show you guys that because I'm not. Can't wait for the bulbs to come right there. And when you plug them in, it's gonna look so cute um we do have package from miss birdie as well oh I, my rug so my rug is supposed to come this is also another package this is my grip pad the rug pad i receive it already and my my address is there so they're gonna have to cut that out i was trying to add the front because the address is on the front and it's also on the back who pull out the ear Car queen ear pull out Tell Queen to pull out her hair. Yes, Go put that back. Oh, she jumped, she jumped behind her back. She's hiding it. I see it. All right, so that is dot. Can you put this put this up on the makeup room? Do not open it. It will. It doesn't. You don't use those stuff on kids. It will damage your finger. Put it up because I don't want Olivia to break it and damage herself. I just lied. Because these kids, they be nosy. It's my cuticle oil and they be nosy. Want to see what you're, you're, you know, what you're talking about. Another thing, let's open the bowl right here. The bowl that I bought from Sam's. I love Sam's. 
the members mark soft oh my god so this is the one that i have it has been in a mail too so let's open these you guys uh, later I'm gonna start uh, all of this put a piece of butter in this and then let it cook at the fish I'm gonna add cock soup listen that's a little trick that I do I add a little cock soup when I'm making my fish and it tastes so freaking good and meat season. That's the five. Oh, there's none in this. Oh, this thing is very good. Fish and meat season. Right here. Turn on the pipe. I need some warm water. in it. I'm going to add some Mrs. Dash and that is it. A flavor, a little bit of Mrs. Dash. Hey guys, good morning. It is Monday, 
Today's Monday. Today we're closing off this week's vlog. No! Because no. we're going to uh, a furniture store today. No! I'm gonna cut your finger, you have to wait. But um, I just made Olivia. The kids are still sleeping. It is uh, President's Day, so there's no school. But um, I am taking care of this baby right here. They are saying that they say don't cut fingernails on Sunday or it's Monday. So I just put an earring in her hair. She do not like earring. A bit stuffy. But I just put one in her hair. And I um, kind of make it a little bit close. Hopefully she can't take it out. And I got some of the one that we use to pierce the hair. You know, in Jamaica, that one, the medicated one. That's the one I get because I don't want to spend too much money and then she lost it because that's what she do. Everyone that uh, buy her earring, purchase earring for her, she, she lost them. So that's what we're doing. Ow. So I'm trying to do everything with Olivia until they wake so I could make them breakfast because she still had school. So he went to school. So yeah, I'm doing everything with them. With Olivia rather. Stop, you gonna fall. Before the kids are up, Olivia here needs to comb as well. Her here, but I just cleaned her, her hair wash yesterday, so I'm gonna comb her here today. Um, yeah, a matter of fact, I'm gonna comb it right now. I'm making myself some tea, so I'm gonna um drink my tea and then sorry, comb her here. By then, the kids will be up, and I can make them breakfast and take care of them. So that we could get ready to go um, to rooms to go. We're going to rooms to go. So what happened with rooms to go? I have a claim with them. They give me the option to get a new dining table, which hopefully they do have. I was checking their website and they literally they don't have nothing. However, could you tell me why I have insurance? But first of all, rooms to go, I, I don't recommend them. I'm just telling y'all, I don't recommend them. Why? Because not of their products, because I used to love them. I love them so much, I get a credit card with them. I don't do credit cards for furniture store, period. Like, that's me. I mean, you know, people do it, but I don't. And I went ahead and I got a credit card with rooms to go, right? All of that. So they're gonna tell me that the kids furniture they can't do nothing on it first of all do not put no it don't make no sense you put insurance or warranty on no furniture because they're gonna find ways i'm pretty sure they're gonna find ways to um to not replace or fix your stuff and i'm i'm so upset with them right now i don't recommend them they don't tell you to read the fine yeah. prints you understand they don't like i was saying with rooms to go do not buy furniture from them and i repeat why would you put protection on your furniture first of all when you go into a, a furniture store they're not telling you how oh, read the contract before you put insurance on it the sales people they're gonna tell you that hey it's better to get the warranty or it's better to get the protection because if there's any incident, it can fix lies. They don't fix nothing. I had the problem with a furniture store prior to that. And when I went in store, they have to give me what I deserve. Now with rooms to go, they're trying to play smart. They trying to be like, oh, first of all, I don't care about the dining table. They don't have nothing that looks good. First of all, 
you rooms, rooms to go you guys need to watch other furniture stores that come with stuff that looks good you go on it there nothing is on there so i'm gonna go in store they're telling me they can replace my um my my dining table and come back for this one no i'm gonna go in store just to say that i go in store and i am going to um so distracted because i am upset there's no way people work hard for their money you guys are scammers that's what you are and it upsets me because you guys remember when i put it in a video before and i said to you guys i'm gonna get they're gonna replace my stuff why would you send a technician out and the technician say oh you know what it's best to replace these because and then I come and tell you guys, being happy, no, you guys can't do nothing. My kids' furniture is up there. Why would I put furniture uh, protection or warranty on something that it don't make no sense? Stop letting these furniture people tell you about warranty because they find all the reason not to replace your stuff. No, they want to be in good gesture of you or whatever, talking about their replace the table. When they well know they ain't got no tables in stock and none that looks good. They know that and then they're going to come back and take my old table because you know what? They want to fix this and sell it. That's what they want to do. Fix it and sell it because people probably like this one, want this one, so they, they're giving me the option. Why don't you just give me a brand new table to the one that I have? Is a reason why I bought this one. Yeah, I'm sick of them. Sick of them. Sick of them. I am upset because they had told me that they will replace the stock why would you send a technician these technicians what are they why did this man come into my house first of all this man come into my house at 8 p.m let's start right there when i went out there i'm like it is night you know we're even supposed to come in the house 8 p.m nobody tell me that somebody's gonna come into my house at 8 p.m a man standing at my door at 8 p.m come to tell me that you're looking on my furnitures and then when you do so you told me as a technician that they're gonna replace it because it don't make no sense so because they don't want to replace the kids furnitures and the table which is two different claims they're telling me trying to be in the good gesture I even said to this lady listen give me the kids furniture I don't want no table replace the kids furniture because that's the one I like and there's a reason why I bought that I don't care about the table because you guys don't even have a table that looks good or what I like let's put it right there like I'm just I'm upset I'm upset and they keep they keep going back and forth stop like I, I'm, I'm over it with them I'm totally upset with rooms to go because I am, I don't lie and I came here if you guys remember a couple weeks ago I came here and tell you guys that rooms to go will replace my furniture now they're telling me stuff and you know what too when I was buying my furniture tell me why the kids dresser there's no insurance on that I even agreed to buy over a new brand new dresser because um there is no there was no warranty. I didn't even know that until I'm putting in the claim. And I said to them, this made no sense. The night table is the cheapest thing. Why would I put warranty on the night table and not put it on the dresser? That's another thing. That sales rep made that mistake. And you know what? I'm going back there. That's the one I'm going to. Because people don't have money to pick up. You guys are scammers. And it's so funny. The last furniture store they they did something they give me a brand new bedroom set you guys refuse to do the same talking about table when you know you ain't got no table that looks good come on step up on a game step up on a game i want the kids furniture what you don't want to replace that because that's the one selling like people don't even know how oh, me upset right now my, my chair as well i have a chair that costs over four thousand dollars right in less than one year the spring break i'm mean, gonna put my insurances on it and i don't do no claim so guess what i i am going to do that one and i'm gonna see if you guys mess with me because i am a person that i'll, I'll let things slide my daughter right now Janae's bedroom set there's a tear on it from the first day from city furniture about that one and i'll normally even call them because i'm like you know what it's not a big deal i am not a messed up person 
So now I'm irritated with rooms to go. I will not, when I tell you, you better have something in there so I can take back my word. Oh no better have something in there. Like this, this is just some bullshit. Freaking upset me, man. How can people are spending money and one another tell them, say, put insurance on this and then when it's time to claim it, you know, cover something. So what on, what on the cover? What do you guys cover? Who do not cover nothing? Y'all are scammers and robbers. And Fratagra is the one that they go through. Do not use them. Because Fratagra as well, they are messed up. How can you send a technician out when the technician said, you know what? Replace it. Um, Amelia's chest, the chest. That's not the drawer now pushing. We take out the clothes. Why is it not staying in? It's been like that. And why don't you... Oh, no, no, I do nothing. I don't ask for nothing new. All I ask is to fix the stuff. I don't mind you guys fixing it. Right? Come fix me table. Spray it over. Fix me table. Me not mind. I have kids. I put insurance on every single thing that I buy. Because I have kids. But why should I spend extra money putting insurance on something and you guys are covering it? And then this lady gonna call me this morning again because I guess she realized whatever because I keep messaging them and she's gonna tell me that the time has passed. What time has passed, miss? Huh? The time talking to you has passed. Like, you just piss me off. You hear me telling you? Do not go to rooms to go and buy nothing. Alright. Unless you work there. And you getting something free and don't a matter of fact if you want to buy something do not use their extra insurance something because it don't make no sense it don't make no sense because when it's time to claim they're gonna do the same thing and the first time and it's all messed up you have to try to use certain keywords to try and get claim from them that don't make no sense I'm not supposed to tell you no lie to get nothing I'm being honest. That's what happened. I sent you pictures. I sent videos. So people that's lying, they're getting through. And then the people then where I tell the truth, when I do nothing for them, y'all are whack. Upset me, man. So now I have to go there and I have to see if they have a table. I went online. I went through like 11, 12 or 15 different pages and see nothing that I like. Nothing whatsoever. You guys watch me and realize that out of all the furniture stores, I keep going to rooms to go. I want to do me like this. My people on here, they see that. There's City Furniture, there's Ashley, there's all of these American Signature. And I keep coming back to y'all. And you guys can't do nothing for me. You know how much free promotion me going on? You're telling me some bullshit. You're telling me, oh, I don't even know how me upset. And I don't come and rant. I am upset with them because you know why two things i put insurance on my stuff sent a technician they agreed upon replacing it and then calling me back telling me that the time has passed what time has passed because i put the claim in before the time has passed so what are you saying you know why i feel like you guys realize i have so much stuff i have claim and i put the claim in one time and you pick and choose to see which one you want to cover but guess what i didn't want the table because you don't have nothing that looks good i wanted the kids bedroom furniture why didn't you all swap it out i could get a brand new nightstand a brand new nightstand and the chest for the money of the table i'm gonna buy a table regardless Here. I, I don't even want to do all of this life for real. Do not shop at rooms to go. I repeat, when you pay off whatever you have with them, it don't make no sense. And not just them. There's all these furniture stores, they don't tell you to read no contract. Ain't nobody going to sit down and read no contract before they purchase nothing. Nobody going to do that. And guess what? The salesperson, they don't even say, hey, it's best for you to read the contract before you put insurance on it. They don't do that. They tell you to put the insurance on the furniture just in case of an incident, especially if you have kids and, you know, anything can happen. Lies, 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 lies. My God, irritated by them like... <sighs> so now I'm going to go there today let's see then they're gonna tell me that the limit they give me is 1300 dollars. 
was it thirteen hundred dollars for my table? I don't remember. But hey, oh, if you see anything uh, that costs more, you gonna have to pay the difference. <laughs> Tell you, see, right? You better. Do <laughs> I'm gonna go there. Hopefully, Chrissy is wrong. Hopefully, I am wrong because I'm gonna bring you guys there. We're gonna look on all these dining tables and I'm gonna give you a picture of mine. Can you tell me from right now? This is how mine's look. I was trying to do the measurement to see if, um, to see, because I don't need nothing smaller than this. This is how my dining table look right now, right? It's like a deep gray deep gray color see how that look yeah that needs to clean they told me this is what the technicians say they're just gonna come out and wrap over the chairs and change the old table because this part break off i don't know how and it, it's not when i move this thing broke off how i don't know so this is a table that i have i had to purchase two extra chairs which they know that this is not even in there. They're gonna have to put this in there, right? This is how it looks. We're gonna see if we see anything looks better than this because I'm bringing you guys along with me. All right, guys. So I was just on Target and they have this marble tray that I wanted and it was in my cart for so long. I didn't purchase it, but I'm gonna drive and pick it up. The nearest store to me is 31 minutes. So I'm gonna get myself ready. I'm gonna make the purchase and then me and the kids were going there and then we are gonna go to rooms to go so that is it I'm a bit moody because I feel like my sister is about to visit me so I'm kind of in that mood but hopefully rooms to go pissed me off early and I went you know and I just sat there and I was like I really do need to go pray about it because it pisses me off but um, yeah, we're gonna eat the road. Not gonna dress or anything, just because it was nothing planned. So we're, the kids here comb. Oh, I have to comb Olivia here. So I'm gonna wash these dishes. Kyra was the only one up. I'm gonna make Jimmy and Amelia breakfast. I tell them to straighten their room. In the meantime, I'm gonna comb Olivia here and get myself ready so they could get ready and then go upstairs and let them look whatever they want. So I also make some other orders for other stuff that I need to just drive and pick it up. Just like furniture stuff, there's a white bowl that I really do like as well. So that is in it. Uh, what else? A white bowl. The white bowl, the marble tray, and the gray angers for the kids and the white one for Janae. And there was a little black bowl for $10 that I add to it too. So <laughs> we're gonna go to Ty J's. For sure, Target is hit. We don't we don't miss with Target, okay? So yeah, and then today's President's Day sale. They do have sale, but nothing that I need. I'm gonna take these off. Like it's okay to take stuff off. Once you get once you know what to buy, it is okay to take them off. So I'm gonna take those off once the bulk comes. And I need to check and see if they're here because it said it was gonna be delivered today. So let me get situated. I'm excited to do my living space finally. I'm just waiting on my rug, which will be here in a couple of days. Ooh. <laughs> so you guys will see that in next week's vlog. So let me get ready and then we're gonna hit the road. And don't you come back no more, no more, no more, no more. Hit the road, Jack. Hey y'all! We're lit and we're going on the road. I told y'all before I was on Facebook live and I feel so refreshed being over there like where was you girl where was you so yeah um we're heading on the road now and I'm gonna pull up at a Target first because I do have a drive up order and I'm gonna show you guys that there's one of my stuff that was out of stock so I was like girl why but then I was thinking why didn't I buy the stuff over to the Melania side because I have to go over there and it's going to take me an extra 30 minutes to get over there. So, I'll check in back with you guys when we're at Target and I'll talk to y'all. Right, we're done with Target and... Oh, why did I do that? Guys, we literally have to drive 30 minutes to come and pick this up. And then one of the items was out of stock. 
so it's not a big deal it was it was a ten dollar item it's so funny it was the cheapest item and i really don't know if i really wanted it i just felt like the can uh, my candle would look nice on it it was like a pedestal and you know i was just gonna buy it because it was ten dollars and i had a coupon for like two dollars so technically it would be like eight dollars so yeah so that was it but we are about to go back on the other side because we are going to rooms to go oopsie we're gonna head to rooms to go to look at these tables and see if you guys can see me and see if they have any tables that were that we like so, and hopefully I don't buy no the over the furniture for the kids because I'm a person like that if the sale is good I might put the order in and today's President's Day so they have still it's the best time to buy furnitures and that's why I bought my bedroom set because I think I saved like a thousand dollars summer off on my bedroom set so I'm super excited for that but yeah I'll see you guys this camera is so weird I'll see you guys I don't know where I'm going so I'll see you guys at rooms to go bye all right so we are at rooms to go my pants break completely and I feel so naked but let's go see what they have inside and it is late because I got lost so hopefully we can see something that they have or what's sitting now oh, thank you come I'm gonna start this way all right let's go why didn't I bring a better bag. This is weighing me down. Alright. Oh, I like that. That's a dining table right here. This is a dining table. Not my speed. But let's look around and see all these dining tables that they have. They ain't got none right here. So round one up there. I think this is the patio area, which we don't need to go. So let's keep it busy. That's a round table. We don't need no round table. This is not my style. Not, not my style. They have another round one there. Not my style either. But they have something of this area. Hi, thank you. Which is hair. Uh, where's the modern, modern stuff? Rooms to go. This is uh, like a gray, which I don't like. I, I kind of like the tabletop, but. I like the whole bench area that way shows the beauty but let's let's look around you like it yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. let him go give me your eye this is another one this is glass and we're not looking so at glass cute. oh thank you <laughs> This is small. Guys, listen. If I see something that I like and there's options, then I'll show you guys. But right now, I'm not seeing no option. So, let's see. As I remember this table, I had this table set the same night. Uh, uh, what is this called? Centerpiece. And um, these two. This one right here and this one. When I first came, my first apartment, I had this set. In, and I'm, that's what I tell you. I've been messing with rooms to go for so long. For them to screw me over all right come on guys look at these two no. okay come on so there the tables this one looks cute but i feel like it is too high this one is okay it is not you know but i feel like it is too high do you like this come on baby and the price, what they say it couldn't be, with six years, it cannot be cheaper. Me personally. All right, let's look at some. 
so I personally would want all the chairs to be I don't know I feel like it is too high this the, the stuff they are ugly on the website because in person they look so much better I love the seating and everything I love the table by itself but for some reason I feel like it is too high so we're still gonna look come on Jesus please y'all come get her come you ready yeah so come then now yeah fast you're yeah, fast don't it yeah no uh -oh. all right so this is an option but I don't want no table with, with chairs right here what color is this is it a gray I don't know I don't know if I should change my table just because they're offering me a free table which this one I don't know if I need a high table so come on Jin and then this one over here bye was also another option this right here I kind of like the seating on this but this is too gray gray and then I don't want nothing else with these behind because the one that I have it's just like that so I'm depressed hey Jesus wanna come here now this bedroom set right here we were gonna get for Ginny but they didn't have it in stock because it's like gray with gold <laughs> it's gray and gold and I loved it unfortunately she was being a glam girl these are cute that hey come on fair people in bed she's a come you want a picture let me pose for you now you got it now yeah. you like another one come here too no no come on <laughs> Jesus. Come, let's go around that area. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. All right, come. Yeah. All right, let's see. They have some really nice decors that I love, though. I like these. Stuff. No, I don't. I love this. It's heavy. And then this piece. Oh, the thing fell off inside of it. Oh, you like that? Yeah. You want to go on it? Go on it. Go. Thank you. Go. Make sure you go. Let her learn. Go. Vroom, 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 vroom. Vroom, 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 vroom. <laughs> vroom, 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 vroom. You want to drive the car? All right, come. Vroom, vroom, vroom. Vroom, vroom, vroom. Bye bye. Yeah, rooms to go. Yeah. Guys, come. We have to go. Let's see if there's no more tables inside here. Yeah. Olivia, let's see if they have any more tables. All right, guys. So I move this. I in order to get something and let something look different in the house this one because it's low is the option even though it's gray i think it will complement the kitchen so i just moved these chairs right they had these chairs underneath as well and i just moved them i really do like the table just because i'm getting something free from them only thing is this is too long so i'm wondering if that's the only option that they have with that being said i feel like the table is long and um yes yeah, so this like this is like 1400 and uh, i think i like the table with the black foot and everything took these off so this is one because this one is low the other two that i see they're high and i'm gonna bring you guys to it these two are right here olivia's enjoying it um so this is the other option and I feel like this is too high. I love, love the material, the seating. 
love it but i feel like it is too high and me personally i don't want no chairs to be on the end right here i think that's too much however the length of the table is the perfect size as to the one that i had before the one the one at the house no rather is 81 i didn't measure this the, the um the width of it but the length was 81 so it's around the same that one down there is a little bit higher and then the other option there's some people at the table but let me see if i can show you guys is this gray one right here there's people there so i can show you but i'm gonna walk around and see i'm leaning to this one more however when i look at the paper i see that they seem like they have um a chair that is lighter or it's the same thing i'm not sure so i don't know um the table is a bit long uh server i don't know let's find somebody everybody's busy nobody walks up to me as yet so i guess everyone all right this was the other option the people they get up i don't know used to go is kind of be like and this table is even seem like it's shorter it says uh 76 by 41 I feel like these are too high and then I wanted tables with the back not showing and I don't want anything else with that because I had that before so I really don't know there's not a lot of options inside here so this was the other one oh. and this one that I just showed you guys there's really no tables inside here how it would look with the three chairs right yeah. because she did check this piece we don't have to use it if we don't want which is pretty awesome but i'm like do i need this color table the vase that i have with the moss is gray which it would complement this but do i need something dark looks like there's just so much going on that I'm thinking about, I don't know. No! I, mean, I feel like the, the, I don't like this chair. So this is out of it. I want, I don't want nothing with the back out. <sighs> I don't know, guys. I really like the underneath, though. Like it is really cute. It also has the black, but I'm wondering if it will complement my space as well. She said I could come back because some of the stuff the the, the the sale is extended on them so we could come back I don't know and then you bring Jine and she's all in her phone she don't even know how to decide and all well, of them living at the house I said, I said I like you like this one here I don't like that that has chrome on it I don't want nothing with no chrome so I was leaning to this one to be honest that's that so I don't know them lock off the music so I can freelance in here if I want to yeah I don't know I should not be making a decision right now and look at this child y'all better come and get her in for real <laughs> all right so uh, on a serious note i'm trying to think if this will complement the space if this will complement my home my biggest concern is the gray we are definitely home and i want to show you guys the stuff that i picked up in target um yeah so i'm gonna show it to you guys and then i'm gonna close the vlog off you guys will see hopefully you guys see the furniture is in rooms to go to see if i need to change it or just tell them not to such but yeah i also got the bulbs right here so hopefully they're 60 watt and under because i did not check so yeah let's put you up and see the 
stuff that we get from Target. It's not much. It's just two little stuff. It ain't serious. Anyway, I got some more hangers for the kids. Hold on. So you have hangers. The white is for Janae. And the gray is for Quinn and Kyra. I don't know. We had everything and they don't have no new clothes. So I don't know why. Alright, so this is it. This is a tray. Oh, I love it. Everyone I see with it, I absolutely love it. So I went and I got it. So this is how it looks. It's marble. It's heavy. And all you need to do is wipe it. And then the other bowl is this. like I want this to be on the countertop maybe with some fresh fruit sometime or something like that but it's really cute as well so yeah this is it and this is it this is gonna look cute on a book for sure you can also use it like on your night table say for instance you have jewelry for the night you can put it on it so it's very versatile and then sure if I should have a bulb that's hanging let's look at it from this way or I'm gonna see if it's too bright let's turn this off do you think this size bulb or should I get something that flush underneath I'm gonna check again I think I might need the regular bulb and then I'm gonna see if the what is correct so i'm gonna check on amazon and see this is how they look you guys can't see it so but that is it oh let me show you guys the bowl so this is all the bowl. it's real cute on the color top and then we have this right here the marble tray which is also beautiful so it's five bulbs so we're gonna check i think that is it i don't have nothing else to show you guys but it's a wrap i'm gonna close this week's vlog off and i'll catch back i'll catch you guys next week and you guys will see if we choose a furniture you guys will see this vlog before it's time to choose a furniture this is how my table looks now do you think my table looks better or it's okay to choose one of the ones that i saw but this is it um yeah it's a bit gray like so basically they're almost the same so tell me what you think in the comment section this is my table now or do you guys like the ones that rooms to go this one do have a style on the foot as well so let me know what y'all think and then we'll make a selection either we keep this bear in mind the one that i really would take would the back wouldn't be out like these so let me know what you think in the comment section and then we can go from there i'm gonna think about it to see if it makes sense to me as well but i'm gonna close this week's vlog off so i'll catch you guys next week stay safe always remember god is love i appreciate you guys being here every single week and i'll talk soon see you in the next one make sure you subscribe bye